couch Dogs need the lessons Hey there Lickin' Riffers! Welcome back to yet another awesome guitar lesson here on Lickin' Riff in which you're gonna learn how to play real polyrhythm on guitar. Polyrhythm, in case you don't know, is playing two completely different rhythm patterns simultaneously. And I'm gonna teach you how to play three on four polyrhythm. Three on four is this. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, now if you can't hear it, try to count it. I'm singing one, two, three, four, and I'm clicking one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, ready for this? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Okay, now I'm gonna break it down for you. I'm gonna show you how to play it in finger style. First, I wanna mention that this lesson is sponsored yet again by Skillshare because Skillshare love licking riffers and they're always happy to give you free two months premium free access to all their courses. Skillshare, in case you don't know, is a website and an app for learning, for video learning, learning via video courses. They have everything from graphic design to logo design to music production to mixing and mastering to film editing, photo editing, DSLR photography, creative writing, branding, marketing, business related courses. They just have everything there. Okay, go to Skillshare, click the link below in the description and claim your two free months of premium access two free months of premium membership to Skillshare. She's going to claim it right now. And um, I'm telling you, you're, you're gonna get addicted. So be warned, okay? You're gonna, th this is addicting, just watching video courses all day. And uh, it's, it's incredible. And you're getting it for free. So click the link below in the description and get two free months of premium access to all the courses on Skillshare, okay? That's incredible, okay? So, um, polyrhythm. Right, so polyrhythm on guitar sounds like this. Okay, this is a really, really cool pattern to know because it's unlike any other pattern you might have encountered. Okay, because the thumb plays one, two, three, one, two, three, and your fingers play one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So the way to do it is this, okay? You can't learn it any other way than breaking it down, okay? This is a really, really more of a technical exercise, but once you can do it, once you can hear polyrhythm, it's, it's excellent, okay? So, okay, you pick the whole chord, okay? I'm playing D, so you pick the whole chord with the bass, okay? Strings one, two, three, and four, okay? With your thumb. Okay, the D string with your thumb, of course, this is finger style. So, okay, this is the one, okay, the first beat. So, okay, then you play chord bass, okay? One after the other. Okay, it's pam, pa pam. Okay, it's chord and bass, and then chord bass. Okay, the next move would be this. Okay, then it would be chord bass with a little more space in between the chord and the bass, okay? Now, this is where you have to be precise because the first chord bass couplet is ta-ta. The second one is ta-ta, okay? Okay, got it? Okay, and then right after that last bass, okay, the third bass note, right afterwards, you play the next chord. So it's ta, 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 ta chord, okay? It's, it's I know, th th there's no other way to break it down other than slowing it into absurdity, but that's the way to learn it. So, okay? It's bass and chord, chord bass, chord, bass chord, okay? So once again. Okay, and once again, once you, you wrap your fingers and ears around this concept, it's really cool to know that you're playing two rhythm patterns simultaneously. So once again, I'm gonna slow it down. Okay, together, chord bass, chord, bass chord, okay? 
Okay? Count with me. Da, 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 da. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay? And my clicking is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay? I'm counting the clicks. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. 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 This is a really cool talent to have. This is a really, really cool skill to acquire. It's kind of like speaking one thing and writing a completely different thing. Okay. And it helps you in finger style because in finger style you have to think, um, let's say on several different levels, different musical levels. That's why you need to learn polyrhythm just for the heck of it. Okay. <laughs> And um, once you can do it, again, you can just show it off and say, hey, I can play polyrhythm on guitar. So before you go and practice this, again, click the link below in the description, claim your two free months of premium access to Skillshare, okay? And go get addicted to their courses. It's a wonderful platform and go get addicted to it, okay? It's free. So uh, have fun and have fun polyrhythming. So uh, I'll see you in the next lesson. Bye for now. Enjoy. Thanks for watching.